All right, now this is the background of the full screen alerts on the older reminder application. And after updating it to the latest version, this is how the background images look on the full screen alerts when you set a reminder. Samsung has updated the reminder application with some additional new features. As you can see the change log here on the reminder application, it says change background images for full screen alerts, pin categories and set category icon. The latest version is 12.5.01.26. Let me go ahead and open reminder application. You can see we've got all these categories here on the top and the past reminders are shown right below that. Now let me tap on this hamburger menu. I will tap on reminder setting. Now you see under alerts, we have got a brand new option now called alert background. It says choose an image or color for the background of your alerts. Now let me tap on this. You see, this is the default alert background, which we always had. Now we can change the colors of this background. As you can see, we've got a few color options here. I can select any color I want. These colors look really beautiful. Uh, I can also select an image from the gallery here. I can tap on this gallery icon and select whichever image I want. Let me just tap on this particular image here. Now this is how it looks when there is a full screen alert on your phone. Remember this works only if you have selected full screen alert for a particular reminder. If it is a normal alert, it is not going to show up the entire image like this on your full screen. So you have to be wary of that. So you select the image and whenever you set the reminder, set it to full screen alert so that this image shows up when you uh, get reminded of something which you have already set. You can also select a screenshot of something which will remind you of the particular reminder that you have set. For example, let's say you have written a grocery list on the notes application. You can just take a screenshot of that and uh, you can set that as background here by going to the gallery and selecting that screenshot. So whenever you get a full screen alert, you'll also get to see the contents of that screenshot, which will remind you of what you need to get. That's another way of using it. This is going to be really useful. Depends on how you use it. Now let me go back. Now uh, let me show you the second feature that we have got. It says pin categories and set category icon. Now these are the categories I already have. Let me just open one of them here. Now here I'll tap on this three dot button and tap on edit category. Now you see we have got an all new option here pinned to top and we also have all these icons which can be set for this particular category. Earlier we did not have these two options. We could only change the colors of that particular category icon. Now we get to choose any of these icons and we can also select pin to top of the list if you select this, this particular category will remain on the top of the list. You see there are various different icons here. Let me select one of them here. I'll tap on C. Now you see we have got this reminder category with this particular icon and it is also right here on the top. These are some brand new features which you have received on the reminder application. Samsung would have dropped this update on most of the phones and in most of the countries. Uh, do wait patiently if you haven't got it yet. For now, I have got this on the S22 series and the, S, uh, and the Z45, but on the S23 series, I haven't got it yet on the S23 Ultra. I'm still waiting for this update. I will probably get it in a day or two. And uh, if you haven't got the update yet, do wait for it. You will be getting it soon. Now, if you have already got the update and if you're able to use these features, do drop a comment and let us know. And also let me know the country you're commenting from and the model that you're using. That would definitely benefit the community. That's about it. That's all I want to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you find this informational. And if you're interested in the wallpaper and the widget, I have left uh, the links for these in the description. Go ahead and check that out. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.